case. Really? No way. Wow. The reason we came all the way out here in the middle of nowhere to this place is basically just for one room in this house to get some photos for Instagram. We spent like two hours here just taking photos. We got two more abandoned places we're still gonna try to explore today. So let's do it. Yo, and we're back. We're right here at an abandoned NATO communication site. Check out these massive they send a communication signal up to the atmosphere which then bounces it back down to uh, destinations further away for like long distance communication. It's basically been abandoned since the end of the Cold War. Whoa, tons of batteries. That's weird. Check it out guys, we're up here in the mountains. It's actually a bit cooler up here. Just look at those things, massive. This is actually a bunker right here. Let's check this out. Wow. Probably just for extreme emergencies. That's probably another exit. Dude. That doesn't really, but that's pretty cool. Keep out. There's something electrical that they had to keep it on here for yeah. for some other reason. I think it's plugged. It's probably still being used in some way. Yeah. I think there's a weather station here, but yeah. they might be kind of using this space for something. Check this out. Wow, look at these electrical controls. These must have been controls for the uh, communications. So like radio pilot receiver two, noise amplifier. This is something electrical. 8,000 volts. Yeah, I really want to turn these. Okay. Curious too. Oh. Damn, they're like jammed. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> the changes and just like a hole on the ground just drops us down somewhere. It's some secret base. Like. Yeah. It's just like NATO unclassified. That's what this place was called, right? Like, what is this? It's like a project or something. Yo, what's up guys? This is our third abandoned place today, but it might be the coolest one. I don't know, the last one was really cool. But this is an abandoned asylum we're on our way to right now. And it apparently was originally built as a home and then converted to an asylum in 1868, so it's really old. I can only imagine what asylums were like back then. In the history. It says that after housing European noblemen, years of mental ill patients, and even a troop of Nazis, this is definitely one of the most intriguing houses that's abandoned. This place actually has a morgue on the property. A 
original owner of the house, which this was before it was an asylum, uh, had a mentally ill son. And apparently he ended up turning this whole place into an asylum to uh, help people who were also mentally ill. So we're trying to find this particular room before it gets dark. Um, it's kind of the highlight of the place. We want to start there and then explore the rest of it as much as we can tonight. I think this is the place. Uh, Let me show this one online. This is like where all the, the stuff went down. So this is the actual place. Oh my god. No! 